Hi, James here. I recently made a crescent moon for my Marvel game. I wanted a blood red marble with a crescent moon inside it. I thought it was kind of cool how I did it, so I thought I might show you just how quickly and easily you can model some of these shapes. I'm going to delete the default cube. I'm going to add a curve and I'm going to choose a path. And I'm going to rotate it 90 degrees in the Y. And now I'm going to tab into edit it. I'm just going to grab those three, move them across, move this center one out a bit more. So I'm going to grab the scale tool, scale these two out, move, and do this until you have a nice sort of crescent shape that you're quite happy with. I think I might just do this a little bit more. Now I'm happy with that shape. I'm going to tab out of it. I'm going to go down to the data here. Geometry. And just give us some depth. Next I'm going to tab back in. I'm going to grab these two points. I'm going to press Alt. S. And just scale them down. Importantly you do Alt S here and not just S. Otherwise you won't get these nice points. The Alt S scales by the normals and gives you this result. If you just did the normal scale, it would just scale the whole thing down. And that's it. You have a nice, simple, stylized moon. So I hope you found this useful. If you did, please like, subscribe and comment. And I hope you have a great day. Bye.